So this uh, unit has a problem with the under voltage. Some, sometimes it's a, it's a simple fix, uh, but not for this one. We are going to change the rotor stator for this unit. Uh, so we are going to go step by step together and you will see how we are going to replace the parts and fix the, the unit. Yeah, there is a physical damage here. See, this one is completely cut. So, that's why. There he is. Easy peasy contact. Now, Sab, it's yours. A gift for you. I will open it up. The open load. And it's short, so it means that the wires are connected. That one, the wires were disconnected, so it makes sense that it's not working. So we are going to do the test now, gas is open, uh, everything is tight and secure. So yeah, the problem was exactly what we expected. The rotor stayed there, both were defected, so we had to change them. We did the replacements. We are in the final steps to put the screws on and tighten everything. Uh, we did a test, uh, so we have the voltage and frequency that we want. Uh, when, it's, uh, when everything is done and uh, closed up, we will check it with the customer, show it to them, uh, so that they, are, they know that uh, it's working properly. Um, the experience that we had here is that we didn't do this installation. It was by another uh, electrician which was not certified by Generac and customer had difficulty finding us certified technician to get the parts um, and uh, fix the issue. Um, if, if, you, if you're uh, planning to install a generator, our suggestion is to go with someone who is certified so that you don't have um, delays and you know such problems uh, with your generator 
because um, it's a lot faster when you go to a certified uh, Genevac dealer to get the parts replacements and we take care of everything Genevac is pretty responsible we have uh, we are connected to the engineers of Genevac so we have their advice and uh, the knowledge everything is available to us and the parts come uh, pretty quick um, yeah so uh, we had quite a challenge with this uh, generator but finally it's all good and uh, working properly